All right, I think it's about that time. Mm-hmm. Good morning, Shabbat Shalom. Shabbat Shalom. And uh, good morning, Shabbat Shalom to those of you joining at home via live stream. Uh, we begin on page 103 as uh, we give thanks as per the weekend, this Thanksgiving weekend, for the blessings of our everyday miracles. Baruch atah Adonai, Eloheinu melech haolam, asher natan lasech vivina, lehafrin ben yom uvein laila. Amen. Baruch atah Adonai, Eloheinu melech haolam, sheasani betzomo. Amen. Baruch atah Adonai, Eloheinu melech haolam, sheasani betchovim. Amen. Baruch atah Adonai, Eloheinu melech haolam, sheasani Yisrael. Amen. Baruch atah Adonai, Elohinu melech haolam, pokeach ivrihim. Amen. Baruch atah Adonai, Elohinu melech haolam, malvish avrumim. Amen. Baruch atah Adonai, Elohinu melech haolam, matir asuvim. Amen. Baruch atah Adonai, Elohinu melech haolam, zokef kefufim. Amen. Baruch atah Adonai, Elohinu melech haolam, Rokaha aret al hamayim. Amen. Baruch atah Adonai, Elohinu melech haolam, hamichin mitzadei kaver. Amen. Baruch atah Adonai, Elohinu melech haolam, she'asali kotzorki. Amen. Baruch atah Adonai, Elohinu melech haolam, Ozer Yisrael b'gvura. Amen. Baruch atah Adonai, Elohinu melech haolam, Oter Yisrael betifara. Amen. Baruch atah Adonai, Elohinu melech haolam, Hanotin la'yayiv kohua. Amen. We continue on page 122. Baruch She'amar, a celebration of God's creative power. Baruch She'amar ve'hayah ha'olam. Baruch Baruch Oseh Bereshit Baruch Omer Oseh Baruch Kozeru Mekayim Baruch Merachim Al Ha'aretz Baruch Merachim Al Habriyot Baruch Nisharim Sachat Aviyah Baruch Ha'ilad Vekayahem Lanetzach Baruch Padeu Matzil Baruch Shemo we continue on page 136. We chant Ashrei responsively. A transliteration can be found on page 181. <laughs> Kvorotecha yagidu Hadar kavod hotecha Vedivrei nifleotecha hasicha Vezuz nortecha yomeru Udotcha asaprena Zeche rav tuvcha yabihu Vetzitchatcha yaraninu Chanun verachum Adonai Erech abay mugdol chasev Tov Adonai lakol Verachama vakum asav Thank <laughs> you. Hallelujah. 
page 141, the closing words of Psalm 150. Allelu, allelu, vesil sele shama. Allelu, allelu, vesil sele trua. Kolan shama te alleluia. Alleluia, alleluia. Kolan shama te alleluia. Hallelujah, hallelujah. The soul that all that lives praises your name, Adonai our God. The spirit of all flesh exalts you, our sovereign always. Who resembles you, who is equal to you, who compares to you, great, mighty, awe inspiring, transcendent God, to whom heaven and earth belong? We will praise, acclaim, and honor you, and bless your sacred name, fulfilling David's words. Let my soul bless Adonai. Every fiber of my being play, praise God's sacred name. We continue in the middle of page 147 for the beginning of our Shacharit service with Shochen Ad. Shochen Ad Maharom Vekadoshemo Vekadu Vranenu Sadikim Bahadonai La Yesharim Nahaba Tehila Befi Sharim Titalal Uvdivre Sadikim Tit Baharach Uvil Shon Hasidim Tit Romam Uvekerev Kedoshim Tit Kadash Israel, <laughs> Leshabeach, lefa'er lerohomim, lehader, levarek le'ale ulekalis, al kotivrei, shirot v'tishpakot, David ben Hishai, avdecha meshichecha. Ishtabat <laughs> Abokher de Beshire Zimara Melechel, Reha Olahamim. Amen. Please rise for Chatzi Kaddish 148. Yitkadal ve Yitkadash Miraba, Behal Madiv Rachirute Viam Lichmachute, Bechaye Kon, Uv Yome Kon, Uv Kaye de Kobed Israel. Amen. Min kol birkata ve shirata Tush bechata velechemata Damir miyama Ve imeru Amen Baruchu on 149 Baruchu et Adonai hamevorah Baruch Adonai hamevorah Le'olam va'el Blessed are you, Adonai, our God, sovereign of time and space, who forms light and creates darkness and brings harmony to all creation. Please be seated. We continue on page 151. We chant El Adon, a medieval poem of creation. 
ایلا جون الکل هم هستیم بروک و مبارک به فیق و نشمه قدلوم تو و ملیه علم دعوت و دفون سلوی ما تو امید که القای و تکودش دنیدا به قواد الهمر که و زخود می شولیف نهی خیصا سرم <تصفيق> میخیم تیتم فسیم به وام آسیم ایم هرتون کنم به ار و قواد نت نیم نیش ما سال آوری نال زخر مال خودتو کارال آشمش و ایش را خور را بهیت کیم تو را دوانا شه و حق نوت نیم لو کل تبام هرم تیف اره تو گدول است رفیم و افنیم و قیوت ها کوچه. Let's hear the shout out to all the Nazim by Yom Hashvi. تیت برق سورین و ملکین و وگوالین موره که دوشیم ایشتا بکتیم کلاحت ملکین و یوتر مشارتیم کلم احوویم کلم بروریم کلم گیبوریم و کلم ماستیم به ما احوی را رتزون کنم بخم 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 اچیم هایل ملکه گذاهل گیبور بنورا کدوش براش قدول میتنسیم لیومت زرفیم لیومت هم مشابقیم و همریم بروک بردنیم این کومو ار بروک نیمو تیتینو لملخ خیلی بکنیم خطیش بچو Or Hadal Shalatio Hanta Ear, then he's careful on a mera leoro. Paharo Hatadona, page one fifty four. We read together. You have loved us deeply, Adonai, our God, and showered us with boundless compassion. Avinu Malkanu, for the sake of our ancestors who trusted in you and to whom you taught the laws of life. So may you be gracious to us and instruct us. Kind Creator, have compassion for us. Open our hearts so that we may understand and discern, hear and study, observe, perform and fulfill all the teachings of your Torah with love. Enlighten our eyes with your Torah. Attach our hearts to your mitzvot. Unify our hearts to love and revere your name so that we never lose hope. As we trust in your great, holy, awe-inspiring name, we will delight and rejoice in your deliverance. We continue in the Hebrew of Ahavienu. Ahavienu leshalom me'ar ba'kan fot ha'aret v'toholi chinu kolam emiyut le'atzenu ki el bum yeshu adata. Uvanu vakarta mi kolam velashon vekiratanu leshim kahagadol sela behemet lehodot 
We rise for the Shema, page 155. Shema Yisrael Adonai Eloheinu Adonai Echad Ve'ahavta et 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 Adonai Echad אשר אנוכי מצדך היום על לבדך ושיננת מבניך ודיברת בם בשבתך בביתך ובלכתך בדרך ובשוכבך ובקומך וקשרת מאות הידך והיו לתותפות בין עיניך וכתבתם על מזוזות ביתך ובישרך. We continue silently on 156. למה תזכרו ועשיתם את כל מצוותי ואיתם קדושים לאלוהיכם אני אדוני אלוהיכם אשר הוצאתי עצמם מארץ מצרים להיות לכם אלוהים אני אדוני אלוהיכם אדוני אלוהיכם באמת We continue on page 158 with the song of freedom that Moses, Miriam, and all Israel sang as they crossed the sea to the promised land. <laughs> Nora teilot ohu sefana Shira kadasha shibeku gehunim Neshimaka al safatayam Yakad kulam hodu vehim lichu Ve'ameru Adonai imloch לעולם ועד צו ישראל קומה בעזרת ישראל ובדיק נמקה יהודה וישראל גו עלינו אדוני צבאות שמו קדוש, קדוש, ישראל, ברוך אתה אדוניהם, גאל ישראל. We rise for our Shabbat morning Amida, page 159. ברוך אתה אדוני אלוהינו, ואלוהי אבותינו ואימותינו. אלוהי אברהם, אלוהי יצחק ואלוהי יעקב, אלוהי שרה, אלוהי דהיבקה, אלוהי רחל ואלוהי לאה, האל הגדול, הגיבור והנורא, אל אלוהים, כל חסדים טובים וקונה הכל. וצוחר חסתי אבות ואימות, ומביא גול אל בני בניהם, למען שמו באהבה. מלאך עוזר ומושיע ומגן, ברוך אתה אדוני, מגן אברהם ועזרת שרה. אתה גיבור לעולם אדוני, מחיי מתים אתה, רב להושיע. 
Mashi Paru Wapuri Tata Hashem Mekalke Lechaim Bechaset Mekayim Etim Berachamim Rabim Sohomef Noflim Nadero Hofe Cholim Umatir Asurim Mekayim Emunato Dishene Ahafar Mikhamo Hocha Baal Gevurot Umidom Merok מלך ממית ומחיה, ומצמיח ישועה, ונאמן אתה להחיות מתים. ברוך אתה אדוני, מחיה המתים. נקדיש את שמך בעולם, כשם שמעתי שמותו בשמי מרום, ככתוב על יד נביאיך, וקרא זה אל זה ואמר, קדוש, 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 אדוני צבאות, מלוא כל הארץ כבודו. אז בקודש גדול אדיר וחזק משמיעים קול, מתנסים ליום הצרפים. ליומתם ברוך יום אהרו. ברוך יבוא אדוני למקומו. ממקום החמל כאילו תופיע, ותמלוך עלינו, כי מחכים אנחנו לך. מתי תמלוך בציון בקרוב ימינו, לעולם ועד תשכון, תתגדל ותתקדש, בתוך ירושלים עירך. לדור ודור ולנצח נצחים והנינו תראינה תראינה מלכותיך כהדבר האמור בשירי וזכר על ידי דוד משיח צדקך אם לא אדוני לעולם, אלוהייך ציון, לדור ודור, הללויה. לדור ודור נגיד גודלך, ולנצח נצחים כתושתך נקדיש, ושפחה כלוהינו מפינו לא ימוש לעולם ועד, כי על מלך גדול וקדוש אתה. ברוך אתה אדוני, ברוך שמו, האל הקדוש. We continue with the remainder of the Amidah silently, pages May the words of my mouth and the meditations of my heart be acceptable to you, Adonai, our rock and our redeemer. May the one who creates peace on high bring peace to us, to all Israel, to all who dwell on earth, and to this we say, Amen. You may be seated. We continue with Kadish Shalem on page 167. 
Yitkadal vitkadasha meraba. Ana te vrakhu te vim nik makote bakai konu vio mekonu kai de kobit Israel. Bagalav is mankari ve himmeru amen. Yish meraba mevarach le Shabbat Shalom. We uh, continue on page 168 with our Seder Kriyat Torah, the service for the reading of the Torah. In Kamoka, Vahelo, Hima, Dohonai, Ve in Kema, Asteka, Malekutaka, Mahalakut, Kololamim, Umem Shaltaka, Bekolador, Vahador, Adonai, Melech, Adonai, Melech. Adonai 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 Yerushalayim Ki vechol Levad v'tahaknu Belech eram venisa Adon olamim Please rise as the ark doors are open. Ki mitzion te te Torah, ki mitzion te te Torah, Shemot, 
Please be seated. Shabbat Shalom. We have uh, a bunch of guests joining us uh, this uh, this morning. So, if you uh, if you don't mind, I'd like uh, you to introduce yourselves as you're joining us uh, this evening, uh, this morning. I'll call upon a few of you. Uh, start in the back. Yeah. Mac. Hi. Welcome. Welcome. And uh, in the back over here. Wonderful. Glad you could join us this morning. Great. Wonderful. Wonderful. And uh, two of my students over here, you introduce yourselves. Wonderful. Great. Glad you're all joining us. We should sing the song wherever you go. It's always so <laughs> <Would you>? Jewish. <laughs> I gotta tell you, I hate that song. It's so corny. <laughs> it's so it's corny. It's fabulous though. It's so true. I know it is. It is. <laughs> so, trivia question for you. Which two American presidents were grandfather and grandson? No. Nope. They were cousins. They were like second or third cousins or something. Which two presidents were grandfather and grandson? Mm -hmm. I was father and son. Yeah. No, not the Bushes. Adams were father and son. Somebody said it. You know the first names? William Henry Harrison, the ninth president. Benjamin Harrison, 23rd president. In between those two uh, in, uh, where it was, uh, was John Scott Harrison, William Henry's son and Benjamin's father. Now, although he did not achieve the, uh, the great heights of his father or son's political position, he was no slacker. He served uh, in Congress as a representative from Ohio. We just don't know him as well because his father and son were president of the United States. Um, William Henry's father... Benjamin V was a signer of the Declaration of Independence and Governor of Virginia. Now, we know the presidents, at least we should, but how many of us know the names of, the, of all the signers of the Declaration of Independence? Or even the, the governors of certain states. And I lived in Virginia for many years, and nobody knew that, uh, you know, that uh, Benjamin V, Harrison, was uh, Governor of Virginia. In modern Jewish history, many of us have probably heard of Moses Mendelssohn. Heard of Moses Mendelssohn? He was the famous German Jewish philosopher of the Haskalah, the, uh, the Jewish Enlightenment. He lived in the 1700s and paved the way for a new way of thinking and being mixed in Jewish life with a cosmopolitan involvement and culture. Many of us have also heard of his grandson, Felix Mendelssohn. Who was Felix Mendelssohn? Composer. He was a composer, right. He was a composer uh, of the, um, uh, in the 1800s. Very few of us have heard of Abraham Mendelssohn, who was in between them generationally, Moses' son and Felix's father. While he never achieved the fame of his father and son, Abraham did pretty well for himself. Uh, on his own, he was a successful banker. And even so, he knew who he was uh, with respect to his more famous father and son. Late in his life, Abraham Mendelssohn remarked, The first half of my life I was known as the son of my father. The second half of my life I was known as the father of my son. This is a lament of someone who is yearning for an identity of his own, irrespective of his 
familial relationships, something we all do at different points in our lives, in different settings. It's also the situation of Isaac, our patriarch. Isaac was the son of Abraham, the father of Jacob. And the book of Genesis contains numerous stories about Abraham, the father of the Jewish people and the founder of our faith. It tells nearly the entire life story of Jacob, the father of the 12 tribes and the man who became Israel, for whom we are collectively named. However, we only know about a few of the events in Isaac's life, and in almost every case, he is acted upon rather than being an acting agent. The most well-known events of, of Isaac's life are the Akedah, when he is offered up as an offering on Mount Moriah by his father, and when his son and wife collaborate to deceive him and prevent him from giving the birthright to his son Esau. So what are we to make of Isaac? Is he just a transitional figure and not as important as Abraham or Jacob? Or is he the fulcrum on which the entire Jewish story rests and turns? If we carefully understand Isaac's place, we see that the line of Abraham, the covenant, and the entire Jewish project would never have survived and prospered without Isaac. Isaac embodies continuity. Abraham's father, sorry, Abraham, Isaac's father, was a visionary. Abraham created something new. He was the first real person to be in covenant with God, which demanded moral living and the recognition of God's oneness. This was a pretty crazy idea back then. It was revolutionary to believe that an invisible God cares about us and demands ethical living. Would Abraham's innovation catch on? Would it endure beyond his own life? Isaac is there to ensure that it does. In fact, the last thing that is needed after a radical and new idea is another radical and new idea. What is needed is normalcy, putting down some roots, settling the land. If a great leader's vision is going to get some traction, the one who follows the leader has, to, has the task of grounding that vision in reality so that it may continue into the next and subsequent generations. Isaac took Abraham's vision and put it into practice, into the daily rhythms of life, transforming charisma into custom. Last week's Torah portion told us how Isaac reopened the wells that were dug by Abraham, an action that serves as an important metaphor, representing the idea of continuity. As a result of the fallout from a land dispute, Abraham's wells were stopped up by the Philistines. Instead of digging new ones, Isaac restores what was once there, preserving and reclaiming what was his inheritance and birthright. Similarly, God instructs Isaac not to go down to Egypt. In fact, Isaac is the only patriarch who does not leave the land of Israel. As we recall from a few weeks ago, Abraham goes to Egypt to flee from a famine. In our Torah portion today, Jacob flees to Padan Aram to live with his uncle on the run from his brother Esau, who wants to kill him. Even when it's time to find a wife, find a wife for Isaac, Abraham sends Eliezer, his servant, to the land of Aram, while Isaac stays home. There are other unique ways that Isaac stands out from his father and his son, his marital life. Abraham, at minimum, has relations with Sarah, Hagar, and Keturah. Jacob has Rachel, Leah, Bilhah, and Zilpah. Isaac has one wife, Rebekah, with no concubines. His marriage is also the most traditional in that it is arranged between families. Isaac's name is not changed. God changes Avram to Avraham, and God changes Jacob to Israel. God gives Isaac his name before he's even born, as if to say, this is who you are and who you are meant to be. There's no need to change your name or your destiny. Isaac is always Isaac. All these things tell us that Isaac is a person concerned with preservation, steadiness, continuity. There is one thing that Isaac creates, and even that is a symbol of continuity. According to the rabbis, Isaac creates Mincha, the afternoon service of the Jewish daily liturgy. In the moments before Rebekah arrives, 
uh, on her return from Aram with Abraham's servant. The Torah tells us that Isaac goes out uh, to converse in the field. A discussion about the prayer services in the Talmud cites this moment, telling us that this solitary conversation can only be with God. This teaching from the Talmud is part of a larger passage, passage that discusses the origins of each of the prayer services. And just before the explanation that Isaac created the afternoon service, the Talmud tells us that Abraham created the morning service. And immediately afterwards, it tells us that Jacob innovated the evening service. And while this might seem to diminish Isaac's contribution, it actually enhances Abraham's legacy. Isaac's communing with God ensured that God's personal relationship with Abraham would, in fact, continue and that it was not a one-off experience. When we say that Isaac davened mincha, it means that the lines of communication continue to be open between God and the family of Abraham, and that God's covenant with Abraham's descendants was in full effect. Isaac is surely a transitional figure. Our Torah portion opens, we'll hear in a few moments, these are the generations of Isaac, son of Abraham. Abraham begat Isaac. And it immediately continues with the story of Isaac and Rebekah's efforts to have children. Isaac is not a great adventurer like his father or his son, but he plays an indispensable role in preserving and passing along the family's land, inheritance, and covenant with God. We live in a moment that celebrates disruption and innovation. As such, it's easy to forget the importance of preserving the worthy institutions and meaningful ideas that previous generations established. Isaac serves to preserve the faith and commitment of Abraham, his father, to create a tradition that can be passed down from one generation to another. We all have our own individual accomplishments that will be judged at the end of our lives after we, and after we have passed on. Isaac's great accomplishments were not as flashy or well-known as Abraham or Jacob but they were just as important. Isaac's life was the assurance that Abraham's covenant continued and God's promises were fulfilled. And by passing on his faith in God and the blessings of covenant to Jacob, ensure that it would endure for generations, even to our own day. Whatever we achieve in life, may we do at least as much as Isaac did to keep alive what was passed down to us and impart that to the continuing generations and the continuation of the Jewish people. Shabbat Shalom. We continue with our Torah reading today. We'll do uh, three aliyot. The first three readings. We'll begin on page 146 of the Eitz Chaim Torah Commentary reading the introductory verses of Toldot. There we go. So for our Aliyot, we'll do, um, we'll do either side. We'll do first Aliyah will be this side, second Aliyah will be this side, and the uh, third Aliyah um, we'll do from up here on the Bima. Um, so, let us begin. Please rise, this side. Okay. Baruch Adonai Baruch Le'olam Va'ed Avraham holid at Yitzchak, Vayehi Yitzchak, Ben Arbaim Shanah, Bekakto, Bekakto, Etrivka, 
בת בתואל הרמי מפתן הרמחות לבן הרמי לא לאישה ויתר יצחק לאדוני לנוח אחישתו כי הכרה היא ויעתר לו אדוני ותהר רבקה אשתו ויתרוצצו הבנים בקרבה ותאמר עם כהן למה זה אנוכי ותלך לדרוש את אדוני Amen. Verse 23. Amen. 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 Go for it, Baruch. Amen. We'll uh, recite that third blessing from up here. Baruch Adonai Hamvorah. Baruch Adonai Hamvorah Leolam Vahed. 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 ויגדלו הנערים ויסב שודע ציד איש שדה ויעקב ישם יושב אוהלים ויאהב יצחק את עשיו כי ציד בפיו ורבקה אוהבת את יעקב ויעזד יעקב נזיד ויבוא עשיו מן השדה והוא עייף ויאמר עשיו אל יעקב, הליטיני נא מן האדום, האדום הזה כי אייף אנוכי, על כן קרא שמו אדום, ויאמר יעקב, מכרח היום את בכורתך לי, ויאמר עשיו הנה אנוכי הולך למות, ולמה הזה לי בכורה ויאמר יעקב, השבתי, סורי, השבה לי כיום וישבה לו, וימכור בכורתו ליעקב, ויעקב נתן לעצב לחם ונזיד עדשים ויאכל וישת ויקום וילך So, 
just a, a couple of brief comments uh, before uh, we rise for Hansi uh, Kharaj and Mafti here in a second. Um, we had a really interesting discussion about uh, Jacob and Esau in Torah study, and I just want to give a couple of highlights of that as it uh, applies to our uh, Torah portion and to our Haftarah coming up in a minute. Um, that, you know, a lot of this is, um, um, you know, th this, this Torah portion begins with the enmity uh, between uh, Jacob and Esau, even in utero. Uh, they're struggling in in uh, Rebecca's womb, um, and as we as as we see here in that um, uh, you know Esau is uh, is is quick. He's impulsive. He's a man of the outdoors, um, and Jacob seems not to be. Jacob has a different character, um, and uh, Rebecca. And I mentioned this earlier that that the word favored here I don't think is a great translation because it's it's love, and Isaac loved. Esau, and Rebekah loved Jacob, but it also doesn't say that they, 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 each parent didn't love the other child. Um, and so I think it, it's, it's important to read that in, that it's not necessarily that they favored it, and, and they, I think they, they love their children, um, but the way it's told creates this conflict, um, which, which develops between them. And that leads into our Haftarah, um, where Malachi, writing um, in the and speaking in the, in the the Second Temple period or the early Second Temple period, um, there is great enmity uh, between the people of Israel and the people of Edom, um, and there's you know the. Jacob and Esau and their descendants actually get along pretty well throughout the biblical period. Um, they do reconcile in a few uh, chapters later on in, 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 our, in our Torah. And when Israel is watering into the wilderness, God says, don't attack Edom. He's your brother. Don't attack Edom. This is a, an important, uh, this is an important relationship. He's your brother. But something changes later on where, um, uh, where Edom is either... Uh, participates or just stands, sits by and watches the destruction of Jerusalem by the Babylonians, and that kind of sours everything. Um, and that leads us to um, the, uh, these, these statements that we find in our beginning of our Haftarah, which is that um, uh, where God says, uh, basically, I love Jacob and I hate Esau. Like the, the first word I hate that, that's that's in our it's in our haftarah it's in the book of Malachi um, that does not appear at all in the Torah they're brothers they fight they have a complicated relationship they res, they they reconcile those but it gets so bad that later on in our haftarah we're going to see it's a it's a terrible terrible split um, and the rabbis uh, do lots of um, uh, creative interpretations with those things um, and so we'll see that in a few moments um, please arise for a chatzikarish. Amen. Please be seated. Tahamon, Echazan, Maka, Peshavat, Shimon, Feshashan, Nimatz, Mirod, Yisrael, Maftir, Achazaka. Maftir can be found, page 161, verse 7. 161, verse 7. Baruch, Adonai, Hamvorach. Baruch, Adonai, Hamvorach, Leolam, Vahed. Baruch, Adonai, Hamvorach, Leolam, Vahed. Baruch, Adonai, Elohim, Melech, Olam. Asher, Bachar, Banu, Mikol, Hamim, Benatan, Lanu, Atorato. Baruch Amen. 
و یا هر صحب که راوت به نوت کنان به نهی تراک ویف و یه وقت صحب الیش مایل و یکه ات مخلات بات بات یش مایل به نبرهام آکوت نوایوت آن شهاب لولیش Babru Bata Adonai Elohinu Malachawla Mashir Natan Lanu Torata Met Vechaye Yolaham Nata Betokhinu Babru Bata Adonai Notin HaTorah Please rise for the lifting and dressing of our... Our Haftarah can be found beginning on page 163. Um, we read uh, the opening verses from the first chapter of the book of uh, Malachi. Malachi. Um, we'll read verses 1 through 5 and the concluding verses, chapters 2, 4 through 7 on 165. Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu melech haolam Asher bakar bimvim tovim Veratah vedivrehem manemarim bemet Baruch atah Adonai Aboker batorah Uvemoshe avtohu v'Yisrael amot Uvinviei ahemet Vatzedek Masa dvar Adonai El Yisrael Beyad Malachi Ahavti etchem Amar Adonai Ba'amartem Bama ahavta Hadu Halo ach Esav Layakov neum Adonai Ba'ohav Et Yaakov the ete sahav sanehitim va asihim et harav shema mahav et nachalato letanot midbar ki tomar edom rusha hashnu venashuv venivneh kor vavot ko amar adonai tsevot hema yivnu va ani eheros te kar uhulahem gevul risha ve ha'am asher za amadonai adolam ve enechem tirena ve atem tomeru yigdal adonai me'al ligvul yisrael yidatem ki Shilachti alechem et Himi hamitzvah sohot liyot beriti Et levi amar adonai tzavahot Beriti 
הייתה איתו החיים והשלום ואת נמלו מורה ויראני ומפני שמו ניחתו תורת אמת הייתה בפי, בפיה ועבלה לא נמצא בשפתיו בשלום ובמישור הלך איתי ורבים השיב מעוון כי שפתי כהן ישמרו דעת ותורה יבקשו מפיהו כי מלאך אדוני צבאות ברוך אתה אדוני אלוהינו מלך העולם צור כל העולמים צדיק בכל הדורות היה לנאמן האומר ויוסה המדבר ומקיים שכל דבריו אמת וצדק נאמן אתה הוא אדוני אלוהינו ונאמנים דבריך ודבר אחד מדבריך אך הוא לא ישוב ריקם כי אל מלך נאמן ורק אמן אתה ברוך אתה אדוני היה לנאמן בכל דבריו רחם על ציון כי היא בית חיינו ולאהובת נפש תושיע במהרה וימינו ברוך אתה אדוני משמח ציון בבניה שמחינו אדוני אלוהינו באליהו הנביא עבדך ובמלכות בית דוד משיחך במהרה יבוא ויגל ימינו על כיסו לא ישב זר ולא ינחלו עוד אחרים את כבודו כי בשם קודשך נשפט הלא שלא יכפה נרו לעולם ועד ברוך אתה אדוני מגן דוד על התורה ועל העבודה ועל הנביאים ועל יום השבת הזה שנתת לנו אדוני אלוהינו לקדושה ולמנוחה הלך אבוהוד ולתפארת על הכל אדוני אלוהינו אנחנו מודים לך ומברכים אותך יתברך שמך בפי כל חי תמיד לעולם ועד ברוך אתה אדוני ברוך שמע מקהדיש השבת אמן שכח Thank you. We continue on page 183. As we pre- uh, prepare to return the Sefer Torah to the Ark, please rise. everyone had a uh, nice Thanksgiving nice Thanksgiving weekend any uh, things that anything that stood out from your Thanksgiving meal something that, that uh, any special foods or good good good, uh, good company that you enjoyed at Thanksgiving this year any memories no yeah Would you, what, just as a side dish, do you put on anything in particular, or? Just as a side dish. Side dish, yeah, sauerkraut. Yeah. Chicago and Indiana troops 
sauerkraut. Yep. That's right, sauerkraut. Yep, Maryland sauerkraut. It's a Maryland thing. It is, Maryland thing. Yep. Jenna made her uh, amazing potato kugel. Um, that actually originated when Thanksgiving and uh, Hanukkah co uh, coincided about 10 years ago. And we wanted to like maybe have latkes with, with our turkey, but like it would just have taken too long and, 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 and you know, stunk up the house with all the other food that she's trying to make. <laughs> so we decided on the compromise of a potato kugel, um, which has all the essence of, a, of, of latkes, but it's just you know, in a casserole form. And um, it was just amazing. Kugel and turkey go together really, really well, and I was very excited when I when I because I requested every holiday, every Passover, every Rosh Hashanah, every Thanksgiving. I requested, and she like nine times out of ten says no, I'm not making that again. But I requested it this year on a whim. She's like, sure, I'll make it. Like, so yeah, um, that's it's gone. It's already gone. We had some leftovers, but it's already gone. Um, I'm actually glad because like all the oil in it goes like right to my stomach. And any other good foods that your uh, your Thanksgiving? Yeah. I raked a very large quantity of leaves, and then I stuffed some acorn squash with not with leaves. <laughs> That's <And> good. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> what did you stuff the acorn squash with? A mixture of rice and lentils and nice. uh, raisins and stuff. <laughs> stuff. <laughs> stuff for stuffing. Great. Wonderful. Wonderful. Oh, wow, cool. And, you know, soak that in some hot water and leave it in there and all the good stuff. Great. Any other uh, Thanksgiving uh, highlights from your, from your house? No? Okay, well, hope everyone had a great weekend. I have to say, yesterday, yesterday felt very strange um, just because it, it, like, it felt like a weekend day, but it was a Friday, and so like everything was open, and we went out to like the children's museum and had a great day. And then it's like, oh, we still got the weekend. <laughs> so it's just a weird, uh, weird feeling of a. Did anybody shop on Black Friday? No, no. I know Avery was telling us last week that they that they love it. Yeah. They they get up at six a.m. I can't even imagine. Wouldn't want to do that. When I would go through Laurel to get to Bridge Camera. Yeah. Yeah, I, I I can't imagine the Black Friday shot. I just you know, yeah. People, it's like a ritual for some people. I know people who go out on Thanksgiving, like after the Thanksgiving meal, they go out Thursday night shopping. Um, I don't know. I'm too full to go anywhere. <laughs> anyway, I hope everyone had a wonderful uh, and uh, festive Thanksgiving meal. Um, and. Um, we're back to work on Monday, and in a few weeks we uh, celebrate with Hanukkah. So that'll be uh, a lot of fun coming up uh, in several weeks. We continue on page 204. We join together, sing Ein Kelohenu. Ein Kelohenu, Ein Kadonenu, Ein Kamakenu, Ein Kamoshienu, Mi Kelohenu, Mi Kadonenu. Mi chemakinu, mi chemoshinu, no de lelohinu, no de la donenu, no de le malkinu, no de la moshinu, baru chelohinu, baru chadonenu, baru malkinu, baru moshinu. Atahu Elohenu, Atahu Adonenu, Atahu Malakenu, Atahu Moshienu. Please rise for Alenu, page two hundred and five. Alenu la Shabea, la Dohon Hakol, la Tit Kadula, Leon Sehebrishit, Shaloh, Asanu Keko Yehadatsot. Shehu no tishamayim ve'osedahadetz 
ומשם יקרו בשמיים ממעל ושכינת תזוזות ושכינת תזוזות בגובי מלך אוקיי, נקבל אחד על כקצ'ופה תורתך אדוני ימלוק לעולם ועד ונאמר והיה אדוני למלך על כל הארץ ביום ההוא ביום ההוא יהיה אדוני אחד ושמו 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 אחד Mourners and those observing yard sites, please remain standing. In reciting Kaddish, we affirm our awareness of holiness in our lives and recognize that much of our experience of God's goodness, grace, and love comes to us to those whose lives have touched our own. On this Shabbat, we remember loved ones who have died in recent days and weeks. Myrna Fang, Irving Katz, Milton Siegel, and Barbara Cohen. We keep them in our hearts alongside uh, those for whom we mourn and those whose yard sites occurred in the last week in loving testimony to the faith and the links of the generations. Those who mourn and all who remember join the recitation of the Kaddish, page 207. Yit Gadal v'yit Kaddash Shemei Rabbah v'yalma divrach hirutei v'yamlich malchutei v'chai echon v'yom echon v'chai dechol beit Yisrael v'agala v'yizman kariv v'yimru amen יהי שמי רבה מברך לעולם לעולמי עמיה. יפרח וישתבח ויתפאר ויתרומם ויתנשא ויתהדר ויתעלה ויתהלל שמי דקודשה בריכו. לאלה מן כל ברכתה ושירתה תושבחה תא ונחמתה דאמירן בימה ואמרו אמן. יהי שלמה רבה מן שמיה וחיים עלינו ועל כל ישראל ואמרו אמן. עושה שלום במרומיו הוא יעשה שלום עלינו ועל כל ישראל ועל כל יושבי תבל ואמרו אמן. May the source of peace and comfort send comfort to those who are bereaved. Peace to Israel, to all who dwell on earth, and to this we say amen. Shabbat shalom. A few announcements I'd like to draw your attention towards on our Shabbat leaflet. Monday, December 5th, 7.30 p.m., uh, Cocktail Judaism, um, Reproductive Freedom and Jewish Value. Um, Rabbi Dennis Sasso hosts a conversation about reproductive freedom as a Jewish value with uh, Sherry Rudofsky, Rabbi Sandy Sasso, Kenneth Falk, Dr. Lee Meltzer, and Dr. Katie uh, McHugh. Uh, please RSVP. It looks to be a great conversation. The weekend of uh, December 9th and 10th, uh, we are very busy with uh, the Bible Players, a visiting group um, that uh, does some uh, fun, uh, comedic, and entertaining send-ups of everything Jewish. And so we'll have our Hanukkah Shabbat dinner uh, on Friday the 9th, following services. Um, they will be here during Shabbat services on Saturday morning. They'll be doing an adults-only uh, unkosher comedy show Saturday, uh, December 10th at 7.30 p.m. Uh, so RSVP to all of those uh, events, December 9th and 10th. And uh, Hanukkah follows not long after that, um, beginning on Sunday, December 18th um, through December 26th. Um, so lots of so Hanukkah things coming up that week. So wish everyone a Shabbat Shalom, a happy Thanksgiving. And we will conclude with Adon Olam on page 211. Adon Olam Asher Mahalach Beterem Ko Yitzir Niva Lihit Nasa Bechav Tzokol Azai Melech Shemo Nikra Ve'achare Kichlot Hakol Levado Yimloch Nola Ve'hu Haya Ve'hu Hove Ve'hu Yia Betifarah Ve'hu Rechad Ve'in Sheni Le'am Shilo Le'ach Bihira 
בראשית ולתכלית, ולא העוז והמצרה, והוא אלי וחי גואלי, תצור חלבי ואת סערה, תהוא ניסי ומלוס לי. מנת כוסי ביום נקרא, ביעדו הפקיד רוחי, ביעד אישן מהעירה, ועם רוחי גביעתי, אדוני לי ולא מירה. שבת שלום. שבת שלום. And Shabbat Shalom to those of you joining us from home.